sweeties. Okay, something different today. I thought I'd check in with you since I've been MIA from everywhere. No Facebook. I uh, haven't been on Messenger really. I haven't been making videos because I've been tearing out my floor. Look at that. My stinky gross carpet is gone. The stinky padding and all the old crappy tile underneath. So that is bare floor. <laughs> I'll come up with a design for it eventually. But now, since I had to pull everything out to do the floor, I'm redoing my art room. So currently, this is where I'm at. I'll put another set of shelves there. I can edit and such on my big um, computer over there, back in that, that corner. Right there is my laptop, so I'm, once I get all this sorted and cleared off and everything, I can sit and write and learn how to draw and all of that. So studies over there. I have to replace my little fairy lights that are hanging up there that are all dismal. I did find to replace them with, however, these. Let's see, let me put this down here. Can you see those? They look like uh, giant marbles. How cool are those? But they reminded me of marbles and, and um, the marble pictures that we cut out and use as planets in uh, the reverse collage. So yeah, I let out a giant squeal in the middle of Walmart because that's too awesome, I think. But yeah, this is, let me back way up over here, the new setup. There's my new table, looks all organized so far. I have some happy mail collecting under there. I have, if you see down there, I organized, I weeded through so many of those um, National Geographics down there. And decided if they didn't fit in my um, little bitty bookcase, then I didn't need them. There are so many there, it's ridiculous. But yeah, I've, I've got all sorts of, um, on the very, very bottom shelf, I've got books to tear up and turn into uh, junk journals, that kind of thing. Books for reference. I still, <laughs> I still have to do all my tabletop surfaces. It's ridiculous. But move the bookcase so I can have quick grab items over here since I wasn't using them on account of they kept getting blocked in by all the stuff on the floor. I'm trying a shoe organizer over here. Um, these are stacking apparently so I'm thinking of getting a second set um, and stack it up uh, another two tall. I have to move my power strip because it's hideous but I needed somewhere to hang it. I have to uh, set up my light there. A couple more lights up there and figure out somewhere to hang my camera from so that we can art right about there. But yeah, this is, look, I took up the entire living room. All of that. Entire living room. I have to sort and organize part of my use it or use, or uh, yeah, use it or lose it. I have to, um, this is junk mail and packaging and stuff to use but I've got it all in separate boxes which is ridiculous so I'm gonna pare it all down whatever doesn't fit in this box here is gone I'm just chucking it <gasps> there's Miss Zen hello Zen are you awake from your nap darling you don't care <laughs> okay but yeah so I've got to figure out where to put the rest of this stuff and in in the interim this is a working progress box but I've gotten happy mail and more happy mail and I have a box of happy mail in here I haven't even opened yet I've been very good very very good let's see this one came from Miss Anne so Anne darling I will open this as soon as I get my room organized because I don't want to lose anything in there amongst this mess so yeah I've got to get off my butt and oddly enough, it only took a day to get the flooring out. Just a day. But moving all this stuff out and now getting it reorganized and everything is taking me a week. It's, it's ridiculous. I've got my collection of Happy Mails that have come in that um, I have plans for you guys. I know what I need to do with all this loveliness. I still have to organize all that. I still have to organize that some... Um, uh, projects that that are upcoming that's projects that are upcoming and there and that's just random stuff that needs a new home that's projects or work in progress stuff there 
and four happy mail to go out that needs cleaning up and organizing desperately um, but we're getting somewhere I just thought I'd check in real quick so you can see I'm okay <laughs> I, I am. I've just been crazy, crazy busy trying to get all this done and organized. So, um, actually, let me, let me see if I can turn that. This this may not go as I, I hope, but don't mind my... Hi! <laughs> don't mind my messy. I am so covered in dust and dirt and stuff. It's ridiculous. But videos are still planned. Let's see. Uh, through the end of April, and I'm hoping to get all this done by the end of this week and start May's videos I have hopefully hopefully what will be an epic project for lots of us um, more in the mental health um, mental health and, and wellness okay I have shaky hands I apologize um, man that's crazy Sorry, I've got a thing on my camera. It's, it follows your face, and it, no matter if you're moving the camera or you're you're moving. Da -na 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 -na. No, okay. Uh, <laughs> seriously, I am delirious. I I don't feel well, and yeah, this project's taking way way too long. But I did want to share the the marble looking rope lights. I love rope lights. I love fairy lights. I can't help myself. But we'll be back to regularly scheduled. Uh, filming anyway um, and studying uh, in May for sure so let's see I don't know if there's anything I'm forgetting mm, I don't think so oh I did want to share this look wait I'll flip my thing again so I can see what you're looking at look organized so they're right here and I can work on them and they don't have to stay you know, stuffed in a corner. I can see them and just know that they're waiting for me to play in. How fun is that? Yes. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm going to leave this video here, get back to work, and I will show you at the end of this video probably the, the next step, final walkthrough thing. Alright? Know that I love you. Love you, bye bye. Hello, sweeties. Thought I'd check in with you and catch you up on where I'm at with the art room overhaul. Got all the yucky flooring out, and I cannot remember where I updated you at last time. I didn't go back and check the video. But this is the entrance. Look at that. Look at that clock. See this drippy clock? Love it. Anyhow, this is the entrance to said art room. I can pull the, the curtains down if I need to just shut all that off and um, just pretend it doesn't exist, though that doesn't happen very often. Um, I still have to get a set of shelves and put all this stuff up. And I've got these last few bits down the bottom here that I'm sorting through. Um, but they're all um, like stuff. In the right boxes they're all together not sure what to do with some of this older artwork that I've got and underneath it is boxes of images I've been harvesting um, oh that's my bag it's uh, I got 40 pounds worth of weights in there stick it on my back and go walking when I feel so inclined I, I don't do that very often okay I had to cover up that was a piece that I did for the mister oh my gosh several years ago now. This is my upcoming stuff I want to get done. This, the orange ones are emergency stuff and this is all the stuff I need to catch up on uh, for videos. So it's going to be a busy couple months but that's okay. Um, what else is new though? Um, oh this whole setup I got my lights up because it's daytime and I've got all my lights on but um, I plugged them in anyway. I might have to get a shot of them um, at night time because they're uh, they're really fun but yeah they look like little uh, marbles or big marbles I should say see check that out marbles don't mind my uh, electrical mess in the back there I've yet to figure out how to hide it well and have it accessible aren't they cool though like oh my gosh um, but yeah this setup's uh, so far so good um, 
this table, the, the L shape, wait, let's see if I can do this without tripping over. Sorry, I'm, I've got a, got it in my shaky hand, so we're doing shaky cam for sure. But I've got the, the pub table here, and the fold out plastic picnic table thing. But what I've been doing in the evenings is sitting down, going through just stacks of um, journals, and I've started a, a new glue book here. Um, found a honey badger. I like honey badgers because they don't give a crap. So this is what I'm doing with images that I like, but I can't use anywhere else because they're too big. So I'm just making a glue book out of it. This is a stack of stuff. I've got to find um, somewhere to put it. Um, but these are images, they've got all different types and shapes of faces and stuff I can learn to draw eventually. Um, and most of them are just ads and whatever from magazines. Um, but yeah, just all different uh, the di direction of the face or how, you know, how they're lit or shaded. Uh, I've got some black and white. I love her. I really want to turn her into an angel, I think. But yeah, I'm using these as, or will be using these as reference photos. I have a whole bunch of them. I have some. Of course, I'm not going to be able to find them as I need them. No, I'm not. I got some. She's absolutely gorgeous in the makeup. They're, they're makeup ads. But uh, oh, there she is. There she, I see her eye. No, nope, that was the jewelry one. Oh my gosh. Why can't you find stuff when you need it? There she is. They did close-ups in this textury stuff with the, the makeup, which looks great as backgrounds. But the way they've done it is, um, you know, there she is on the front. Isn't she gorgeous? But see the way the, the light's hitting her face? It's epic, epic reference picture, I think. Not that I know, because I have no idea um, how to do it yet. But isn't she beautiful? And yeah, just amazing. I think these are going to have to go on a binder. Um, oh, I can't get the light right without the opposite side coming through. But yeah, highlights, low lights, shading, um, that, the whole bit. Okay, I've just made that worse, so I'm going to leave that there. But yeah, it's, it's coming. It's mostly not organized so much as... Some of it's ready to be used, and some of it's still ready to be sorted, but it's in the appropriate spots for that. This poor corner will be my writing corner. I have a laptop buried under all this stuff I have to sort, and yeah. <laughs> I'm also just now getting to Happy Mail from Anne. Look at all this yumminess she has sent me. Like, oh my god, you guys. Oh my god, look at these. Look at these, and there's so many. I'll have to take it up with Anne to see how she feels about it, but I'm considering putting some of this stuff in um, giveaways when I, I get around to doing my next giveaway, but I want to share some of this. Not all of it, but some of it. Look how cute this is. Like, oh my god, adorable. And it's it, she's used tulle as the uh, the skirt here. How cute. That's going in one of my journals. <laughs> yeah, and I, I still haven't unwrapped half of this stuff. I just got it all out of the box and set it here, and I'm going to play with it probably longer than I should today. But look, she's made these gorgeous embellishments and clusters and things. Absolutely stunning. Look at these. Look at them. And it's all chunks of scraps and bits and bobs and a little bit of glitter. Look at that. Mm-hmm. So these are fantastic. Look at this. Oh, get everything tangled. Look at these feathers that she's made. Like, oh my god, look. The bling and dimension and they're just so stunning. So yeah, I'll be playing with this stuff this afternoon, and I should get onto a regular art schedule, video schedule again, hopefully tomorrow, because I have not done any art in two weeks, you guys. Two weeks, and I'm going crazy. Crazy. 
So yeah, I wanted to play with this stuff first so I can find it at home. Look at these napkins. This is an entire stack of the most delicious napkins. Like, oh my god, look how pretty that is. Look. So gorgeous. I must ask you a question. <laughs> no, sorry, that's just me then. Okay. But look at them. I'm just... Oh. Oh. Amazing, amazing, amazing. And stuff that she, she wrapped things in. I'm saving all this paper. Look, she stamped on the tissue paper. And it's the glittery uh, tissue paper that I love. But look. Click your heels. How cool is that? Look at her. Amazeballs. I'm telling you, amazeballs. And it was this one. Peacocks and change. Uh, yeah, change is beautiful. Aren't they lovely? Just, oh my gosh. And she swears she's not doing a D-stash, but you guys, score! I've got a big corner, cr uh, oh my gosh, brain fat. I call them chompers. What are they? Oh my gosh. Words, I know them. Anywho, cutter, corner cutter, trimmer, punch, punch. So I got a big one now. Because um, the only punch I have is my itty bitty corner punch um, that Shella got me, which is amazing, and I love it and use it to death. So now I have a big one, and I have this look. And again, she swears she's not doing a, a D stash, but um, just likes to share stuff. And I am beside myself. I will be chomping paper like crazy today. Glue sticks, because you can never have enough glue sticks. And paint brushes and markers. And look at this bad boy here. Mm-hmm. I'm going to stamp that on everything. I have not even dug in here, but look, I almost wet myself. Look. I love me some washi. And look, she's got the skinny stuff that I, I can never find when I have the money for it. Does that ever happen to you guys? When you have money for stuff, you can't find it again? What's that say? Way awesome, fun, laugh out loud. No way. My life today. <laughs> and look, look at these. Oh, let's see if I can get one. Stampers. Like, oh my gosh, look, you guys. So, yeah, I'm going to, uh, <laughs> going to sit and play with my um, planners and pretend I'm a planner girl because I'd like to be. Anymore though, I try not to put dates or um, actual pressure on myself to get stuff done because I just freak myself out. But look how gorgeous this is. This is the basket she sent it in. She's got, um, let me come back down here. Look, planner heaven. This stuff's going in my Society of Idea Collectors book. This I haven't even opened yet. I'm going to do that on my own. I'm not sharing it. Sorry. But look how gorgeous this little journal is. Like, oh my god. And look at these butterflies. I love these butterflies. Like, oh, delicious. That is just... I don't even have the words. It is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, I'm trying to stick stuff back in where they don't want to fit. She's made. Look at these. Boho beads, you guys. Like, oh my god, I have a baggie of them. How delicious. Delicious. And stretchy cords in the silver that I love. And look. Look. I see journal making in the future, my friends. Journal making. What else we got in here? Oh, oh, I cracked into these already because, well, it's candy and I love candy. Um, and I'm not familiar with any of these brands, but I did try this one and it's a, oh my god, it is so delicious. It's like a coffee, um, yeah, it's, it's a coffee hard candy. Oh my god, it's amazing. <laughs> So yeah, this will be in a special stash right by my art table here where I can eat candy. <laughs> oh, look at this. I don't know if you guys are familiar with recycling um, 
the lids that come on your candles. But look, I'm so happy to see somebody still does this type of stuff. This is a pin cushion made from a recycled candle jar lid. You put felt on the bottom, you can put cork on the bottom. Um, yeah, and then you just go from there. Look how gorgeous it is. I can't even tell you. So lovely. And the pins, I don't know if you guys are familiar with these either. This is something we used to do back in the day. Look at these pins. Aren't they fabulous? Just, oh my god, I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Look, when you take fancy quilters pins with the, the big um, heads on top, or you can get just standard ones and um, glue a bead or pearl or what have you on top. And then add your beads and your bling and glue them in place. And then you have fancy smancy pins. But look how gorgeous it is. Just, oh, delicious. Look at that center. Look. How pretty is that? Oh my gosh. I almost forgot. I'll stash them over here. Oh, I've got tea to keep me going. Yeah. Gonna make some of that here in a minute. She also sent, and you are amazing. This is just, I've been feeling on these. Look, different types of fabrics. Look, how perfect is that going to be for angel wings, you guys? And fairies. Oh my gosh. Gorgeous, gorgeous gorgeous and she's got all these pins together so I have to be careful not to uh, poke myself as I do but look it's all textury like each piece ah oh, yeah I'm gonna have to set up the camera I'm not sure where yet but look it's like this really fine what do you call that webbing I, I, I don't know I just know that they're all gorgeous they're, look me yeah, peel one layer Look at that. Again, bird wings, angel wings, just amazingness. So this stuff's going to pop up everywhere. And then stretchy plastic netting that we can use everywhere. Like the tool. But this is fantastic. Just, just a feel on it. If you can get that way up close. Maybe, I don't know. I'm sorry, this video is probably going to make somebody hurl. Um, just from moving. Look! So cool. Gonna have to get me some canvases and do some serious mixed media pieces, I think. Okay. Oh! Oh! That's not all! <laughs> I'm so spoiled and I, honestly, just thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll try and move this stuff. My hand is locking up. I've got little stuff. I haven't even dug through this yet little stuff to play with. I've got delicious doilies. Like, oh my god, look this triangle one. I've never seen a triangle one. Just, oh my gosh, look, spider webs. So yeah, there's fun to be had. And I need this in my life, like, so badly. That is the cutest thing I've ever seen. But yeah, I'll be putting that over by my computers so I can jot down those last minute things I always seem to need a piece of paper for. More stuff that things were wrapped in that's oh, delicious. Just delicious. Love it. And look, she's made some ATCs. And they're so gorgeous, I can't even tell you. Born to be wild. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Noteworthy. How cute is that? Oh, good, you did sign the back. I didn't check earlier. Because I need to start collecting these ATCs you guys are, are sending me. Oh, wait, that's uh, notes. I'm not sharing those. I'm not sharing the notes. And another one. Oh, wait, that one I will because this was nail on the head today okay so it says when you put your attention on what you can't do then you'll manifest what you don't want that is so true and 
uh, the other one was comfort is the achieve uh, comfort is the enemy of achievement. Also, so true. I love when you guys get me. I do. <laughs> I do. And thank you, Anne. This is this is amazing. And um, yes, I'm working on your box still. It's going to take me a little bit because oh, I am so slow at this stuff. Plus, the weather's warmed up, so I've been out doing yard work. Hence the epic tan. Well, except for my legs. Those are really white still. <laughs> Look at this. I don't know if you guys are interested or not, but I have friends that are pilots, so this tickled my soul like nothing else. But um, it's the FAA um, map for pilots. Uh, so flight... Uh, God, what are they called? Oh... Uh. planning charts. But yeah, I'm I'm digging this. This is Oh, it's so cool. So cool. That's going in journals. She's also sent me which I I laughed so hard because I still cannot find one binder of all the stuff that I've misplaced. It's one binder. I cannot find it anywhere and I have turned the house upside down. At any rate, she sent me some more of these, so I can now collect, well I've been collecting, but I need to protect all the ATCs that are coming in and put little bits, um, I want to use these also for, for little, um, what do you call them, smaller ephemera and, and um, like little cutouts and stuff for collage and that kind of thing. So and thank you, you're a lifesaver. Amazing. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this one-handed because, oh my gosh, so heavy. And I'm seriously hoping you didn't sell a kidney for postage because, oh my god. Look at this, you guys. This is an entire stack. Look at all these magazines. And I've only flicked through a couple, but I'm going to sit down. I'm torn. This stuff, these are, what, 89... Winter of 89. Oh, I don't even know on that one. But they're, they're the old... Man, I have so much glare. Craft magazines for doing embroidery. And look at this. Stuff you can make. Look, I'll see if I can do it without glare. Uh, hang on. Can you see? Look at all the detail in that. Look at that. It's amazing. I used to make stuff like this all the time. And yeah, since my girls are grown, I just don't anymore. Look how cute. All this little stuff, see? Do you remember making the um, vacuum cleaner covers that look like a big cow or a big cat? But look, it's full of patterns. It's full of how-tos and refreshers and patterns. I am so... T look, look! I'm so tickled. Like, this is magic. This is absolutely magic. So I'm torn. Do I take out the, the patterns and make new folders full of the stuff that we can make? Or do I use these for junk journals and magic? See, look. Stuff you can make. How gorgeous is this? Just blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Cannot even speak. It's so cute. Do you remember making the geese, the big overstuffed geese, and you put a rock in the bottom and make it a doorstop? <laughs> it's been so long. Look at all these charts. Tiny, tiny, tiny. Giant magnifying glass anymore. I love them. Oh, oh, look. Oh my gosh, but yeah, they're all, it's knitting and cross stitch and sewing and just, oh my god, gorgeous, gorgeous stuff. So I'm, I'm going to sit and just flip through these and, and pat them, you know, like I do, but and I can't thank you enough, darling. I also have also have because I am so spoiled. Let's see if I can do this. Oh if I lean it gently I might can do it. Alright you guys hang on. 
very gently. Oh my gosh. I am so spoiled, it's ridiculous. You guys are amazing. Amazing. Oh, oh, there's more. Oh my gosh. I have to find homes for all this stuff too now. Okay. This box came from Miss Tammy and oh my god, lady. Look, she sent little little bits. Look, see? Actually, did you sign yours? Yes. Well done. Perfect. Yay! She's made these little library pockets out of gorgeous painty papers. Um, I'm not going to read that out loud. I'm going to make a separate pile over here. She's cut out. She's got um, the Big Ben clocks and that kind of thing. Just, oh my god, so much yumminess in here. I've probably got it all upside down. I did look through it and feel on it. Um, I was taking a break the other day. And I was like, oh my gosh, look at that. But yeah, she's got all sorts of deliciousness going on in here. Look, painty papers that feel amazing. I mean, look at that one. Look at that. So, what I'm going to do is make a... Um, well, it's going to have to be several... Look at that. Look at that image. Um, several friend mail journal journals I can't even talk today um, so yeah happy mail happy mail journals normally I, I alter a book to put happy mail in but you guys are so generous for sharing your painty papers that I have to do something amazing with them look at these images because she knows I'm doing the um, abandoned places see look cut out this this center here there's a perfect planet or dark moon or some such. Look at them. Look at them. Wait, glare. I apologize. Oh, I wanted to play and share before setting up my camera, which was probably not the best plan. Look how many cool images are in here. Look at this. We can use this stuff for everything. Like, oh my gosh. Look at that. That's awesome. That could be the center of somebody's eye, like the reflection that what they're looking at. Oh, oh, I have a plan. I have a plan. Look at this. Make something creepy. Hang that somewhere. This is amazing. Look, I have plans for this stuff too. Just gorgeous and quilt work. Look, look, look. Patterns. Oh, I love them. I don't have the patience to do quilting anymore, and honestly, I only ever really like just making the quilt tops. I hate the actual quilting part, but I love handmade quilts. <laughs> Look at that. So beautiful. And she sent me this boho, what is it? Country sampler boho, boho style. I can talk. But yeah, and, mmm, yum. Cake. Look at this. Just so much deliciousness. I don't know if I should use it, just keep it for ins as an inspiration book, or use the images that in it that are amazing. Look at that wall. Like, oh, so much purdy. Look at this. This is what I'm going to do someday. Have art and have it printed on pillows and, and quilts and shower curtains and stuff. Look! Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. But yeah, we can use all of these. Like, oh my gosh. <gasps> Look at the rhino! With the flowers! <laughs> It's so cute. That just makes me happy. Look, there's a one with a donkey and the flowers. <laughs> Gorgeous. God, look at that. So beautiful. So yeah, there's so much inspiration in here. It's ridiculous. Oh my god, there's a giraffe with the flowers. Oh, I'm gonna have to learn how to paint those. <laughs> But on top of that, Miss Tammy has found, look, oh, I have so much glare. Try that. No. 
outer space calendar the perfect storm with the lightning because you guys know me I love my lightning mm-hmm but look at these images we can use yeah that is way too glary I apologize okay I will quit <laughs> I will quit for now and well I'm gonna just pat and love on all this gorgeous stuff like oh my gosh I gotta figure out the rest of this if I want to hang that I've got my lights hung up and power ready for camera so I don't have to worry about you know filming for two hours and it dying because these are gonna take me some time look they have their own home how gorgeous is that but yeah I'm getting there you guys I <laughs> I'm getting there I'm gonna try to work my butt off and it's like okay any time now I'd be good but I need to art. It's been two weeks and I, I can't I can't not art anymore. It's driving me crazy. So I will leave this here and let you know that I love you. I'm thinking of you and prayers and good juju to all of you. Good vibes. Okay. Remember to breathe. I love you. Bye.